This specific boat for me has been a sentimental build. I've known Brad and Lisa and, and the family for several years and I was actively involved in the build of the two older boats that they have been running. When we took the contract to build this boat for him and then I was uh, awarded the opportunity to build it, it was kind of like stepping back in time. But what was fun for me about it was to be able to take all those years of experience and then work closely with Brad and Lisa and uh, kind of ramp it up for them. Well, it's fully custom boats, so it get to be a little on the creative side and it's not cookie cutter. Got to know Brad pretty well the last number of years, so that was that was pretty neat to be part of building them a new boat. I'm not doing a real good job here. Should have had a six pack of beer. Uh, another part uh, that's been incredible with this build is working with uh, some of the Bayweld crew that have been involved in the build of some of our other vessels uh, built nearly 20 years ago. Well, I've been with Bayweld for 19 years. Oh, right around 26 years I started kind of started off as the floor sweep. We've been able to bring in several young guys and gals that are just eager to learn the trade in kind of a, an apprenticeship type program. And so it's been a real challenge and a real uh, rewarding opportunity to teach the younger up and coming generation that have an interest in the industry how to uh, take the creative expressions of a customer and bring it to life, turn it into a real product. Growing up, we didn't have a boat, and so knowing what Homer is now, some of the best parts of living here on the other side of the bay in the uh, state park. A goal for me and my wife was uh, to have access to that, and you know, over the years, that's grown into cold water. Our other boats are only able to carry six passengers, and we continually run into larger groups that are part of a wedding party or a family reunion or large groups that are just traveling together and it's nice to be able to put them all on one boat and take them together. The boat's uh, quite a bit bigger. The bow ramp on it is designed for a, a much larger uh, capacity, you know, as far as loading TVs and cargo. It's going to have longer range. You know, it's been a real enjoyable project. It's been a challenging project. It's been a real joy to work with Brad and Lisa. And uh, I'm really looking forward to getting some water under it and seeing the joy of them operating and serving the community and the different adventures they're going to have.